today the off-grid industry only makes a minor contribution to e-waste management. However, as the industry grows, our e-waste contribution is also growing. Uh, it is important that we take responsibility now to ensure that we are well placed to manage this in future. Effective e-waste management is important in at least three ways. One, it will help in depleting the environment while creating opportunities and income generation to people. Two, it will extend the life product it will extend the life cycle of product life, which conforms to the principle of circular economy in line with SDG 12, which is sustainable production and consumption patterns. And lastly, it will enhance viability of e-waste projects. This industry is creating a big environment and social impact through mitigating greenhouse gas emissions from traditional diesel power sources and also providing clean and reliable access to energy to low to middle income countries. Despite all the benefits in the industry, there's a risk of potential negative environment and social consequences if the off-grid products are not handled properly when they reach their end of life. As the industry scales up, we see that there is a risk of solar panels and batteries piling up, which can cause harmful consequences to the environment and to the people. The targeted customer for high quality, affordable solar products are often low income households in areas with limited access to infrastructure. Oftentimes a customer will retain a product in their household even once it's stopped functioning because they've invested in that product and it represents an asset to them. Therefore, it's important that we make the customer journey easy. When the product reaches the end of its life, customers should be able to easily return it to us and also have an opportunity to purchase another product so that they don't have to go back to using dirty fuels. So solar consumers are the most vulnerable because they're the users, the end users of these solar products. And this project is, is good enough because it's not only going to help them, you know, uh, elongate or help them have you know off-grid power alternative off-grid power but then this e-waste management project will prevent some of the practices that can end up you know uh, uh, making them you know vulnerable to e-waste such as you know living lights anyhow and also you know maybe some of the leakages from the lights like the batteries for us Pico solar batteries can has has potential to cause some form of harm in the fields and in the environment in, in general. On aggregate, e-waste is a cost centre for off-grid solar companies. Due to the quality and durability of our products, the number of returns through warranty claims has been quite low. But as thought and regulation shifts more towards an extended producer responsibility model, it's necessary for us to also start thinking about different ways of managing e-waste. In Kenya, some of the major off-grid solar players have come together to start discussing how best to tackle this new e-waste challenge. We have been sharing lessons from the different pilots that have been underway because electronic waste management doesn't provide any kind of competitive advantage to any one player. By pooling our knowledge and resources, we've been able to start thinking about the best standard operating procedures, internal policies and means of reaching the customer to ensure successful take back. The industry can come together to develop a sustainable, scalable and also a mutual business relationship with all key stakeholders within the e-waste management ecosystem, including the informal sector. Also, we can encourage uh, members who have not joined global associations, such as Gogla, to be able to join so that we can be able to share ideas and have one voice. E-waste is a topic that requires close collaboration across actors in order to be solved. Uh, a good example that I would like to mention is the work that Gogla is doing with the uh, Kenya Solar Waste Collective, which brings together actors um, in the OGS space, uh, but also um, funders, donors uh, and other organizations 
to discuss how to get together and, and also how to collaborate with local recyclers in order to uh, increase the quantities of waste that are properly treated and recycled. The industry can come together to work towards an effective e-waste management. Some of the off-grid companies have already established an e-waste management and strategy in their operations. Through the e-waste management hub, Google and Sweatfun have taken the initiative to invite the best market practices and business models adopted by players across the industry. We believe that there is an urgent need to form new partnerships and scale up viable e-waste management practices both across Asia and Africa, which are two of the biggest markets of the industry.